this is an exciting moment. Andrew bought me this Chinese lantern plant and it has what from far as I can see so far just the one flower. I've been after getting one of these for many years because I find towards the end of late summer into early autumn it's wonderful to see how these transform with the little red berries inside a bright orange lantern. It reminds me of Halloween, Halloween pumpkins. So it's quite invasive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put it into this container. I've recently removed some crocosmias from this. So this is going free. And I do think that nice orange will go nice with this brown of the container colour. So I can tell it's going to be invasive because you can see it's a little bit like mint whereby the stems and the roots run round and round the edge of the pot and these shoots pop up. So I don't really want to plant it in the border. And as you can see, it's quite well rooted already. So I'm just going to tease these roots out a little bit. And I could probably get a lot more than just the one plant out of this one containerized plant. But for the time being, I'm just going to plant it by itself. So I've got a pot filled with multi-purpose compost. And all I'm going to do is pop it in, right in the centre. And if nothing else, that flower should turn into a nice orange lantern. So I know at least I've got one. Because when I was in the, in the garden centre, this was the only plant that had a flower on it. So I was very lucky. Because I'm quite impatient. I don't want to wait till next year. I want to see that lovely orange lantern this year. I want to see it now. So that is perfect. So I'm going to put that uh, probably on the decking behind me. So I'm sat in the summer house during the cooler weather of autumn, going into winter. I can see that from the window, from the open door. That's perfect. <laughs> 